Over the past 20 years, plastic and reconstructive surgeons have advocated super microsurgery, in which we reconnect vessels that are thinner than a human hair. This has vastly improved many surgical areas, including our ability to replant or reattach amputated fingers. Oddly enough, even though we've had a rise in super microsurgery, we've seen a massive 50% drop in the number of finger replantations performed in the United States from 2000 to 2010. The authors of this plastic surgery hot topic investigated to find out why. They found that our workplaces are getting safer, on-the-job finger amputations are down a whopping 40%. But they also discovered that the total number of digit amputations hasn't changed much over the last 10 years. So roughly the same number of amputations, but half as many finger replantations. So why? More research is needed, but these authors offered a few insights. Most of the advances in super microsurgery has taken place in Asia and not in the United States. Therefore, hospital staff and hand surgeons may be veering away from this type of surgery. This snowballs into a workforce of hand surgeons with a lack of experience in performing these specific type of procedures. As fewer surgeons are doing replants, fewer are getting the super microsurgery training they need. The authors say that the development of regional centers designed to handle these complex procedures will certainly help reverse the effect over time. More cases performed means more residents, fellows, and surgeons performing these procedures and learning how to do them, which means more fingers or digits can be saved. We implore you to be careful on the job and at home, especially when working with heavy or sharp tools and machinery. But if you're one of those 25,000 or more Americans who will lose part or all of a digit this coming year, you may be eligible for super microsurgery replantation. If you learn more about this amazing scientific advance in plastic surgery, including super microsurgery and beyond, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and visit us at prsjournal.com.